I see her. Cable 2. Grab it and tell me when you're gonna yank it. I'll break the link at my end at the same time. What do you think? What do I do now? What we came here to do. Find the truth. Ask her. Johnny, she's unconscious. Or she's a better actor than we thought. All right, let's do this. Wait for my signal. Here goes. Ready? And... Thank God. Ev? Evelyn, you hear me? What's wrong with her? Honestly, I don't know. Jerking around the cable probably didn't help. She okay to be moved? No brain hemorrhages, damage to the spine? Doesn't seem to have any wounds. Guess we got no choice. Let's get her somewhere safe. Fast, too. Which way? I sealed the doors and managed to power the elevators. Elevators it is, then. Come on, is it really that hard? Please, just one. For me? Won't hurt those rosy... Fine, have it your way. Smoke to your lungs content. Ah, oh, finally. Something better than exhaust in the stench of the city. Don't tell me you don't feel it, too. We going in? Let's give him a couple. You saw how she looked. If it was up to me, I would have splashed some water on her face back at the studio and asked her straight up. It's not up to you, though, is it? Let's go. She's sleeping. At least I think she is. Her eyes are closed and she's not shaking anymore. I would have already killed her by now if I didn't feel so bad for her. You're mad at her? Why? When you asked me to scour her behavioral chip, I was just about done dealing with your shit. Judy, I didn't have any I know. Other... It's okay. So I don't get why... You'll find out in a sec. I'll show you the virtue I found. Okay. Show me. Give me a sec while I set the parameters. Guess we'll find out if our doll really did lose her tune. Come on, V. I'll be the first to admit, this does not look good. Hey, how you feeling? You need anything? I'm not here to nag. Just talk. Listen, Evelyn. I really need your help. It's important. If I don't do anything, and do it soon, I'll die. Well now, look at you.
Have a seat. All right. Roll it. Data was in pretty rough shape. Not all that editable. Huh. Glad you managed to salvage them in the first place. Needs a second to load. Quality's lousy. But I did what I could. What am I looking out for? Every single piece of tech I see? Security? We need a layout of the whole room. We will get everything else we need from the virtue. What about his messages? Only if you can do it and be parfait pour It's most important that he suspect nothing. Try to be your usual relaxed self. And if he starts talking about the biochip himself, uh, should I... Biochip? Will you hear this? That is not of interest to you. You spin the virtue, you come back here. We give you the eddies. That is your one job. The rest is none of your concern. Understand. Let's understand, let's understand. Take a look around if you want. Can't see your face. Under normal circumstances, that kind of encryption's easy to crack. But not this time. Whoever she is, she's got serious net running skills. That, or someone's working it for her. This not Not And if you start talking about the biochip? Oh, I'll ask me. Question we are. Biochip. Chip? Himself? Uh, should I... Yeah, I should... Relax, self. And he started. Iron chip himself? Should I. I. Yeah, What am I looking at? Find a collaborator. What am I looking out for? Every single piece of tech I see? Security? We need a layout of the whole room. We will get everything else we need. You're flying a direct. We'll be What am I looking out for? Every pyramid. What am I looking out for? What am I looking out for? Every single piece of tech I see. Security. We need a layout of the whole room. We will get everything else we need from the virtue. What about his messages? Only if you can do it in perfectly. It's most important that he suspect nothing. My usual. And if he starts talking about the biochip himself, should I? Yeah, might not be important. Maybe. Only from the Pacific. Now it's down our search list. What am I looking out for? What am I looking out for? Hmm. I think I recognize these. What are they? Vive markings. You familiar with them? Not enough to know what they actually mean. Heard of who might use them, though. Who? Could be the Voodoo Boys, but that's just a hunch. Can't be 100% sure. The spine chilling Netrunner crew? Hard to find, because they don't want to be. I wouldn't know where to start. What now? 
Looks like I'm going on a field trip to Pacifica. All right, I think we got everything. What do you think? The woman who hired Evelyn. Any idea who we're up against? Your guess is as good as mine. Sorry, V. Now we know what happened to Clouds. They're the ones who tried to flatline her. Launched a nuke at her ship. So it was punishment? For getting played by her? She knew more than they thought she knew. Couldn't let that go. So that's who she was running from. Looks like Evelyn never told us the whole truth. You're telling me. If I'd known what she'd gotten herself into... Oh, I'm so mad at her. Her only job was to record a virtue. It's pretty damn amazing she managed to organize a full-blown heist. And swipe the biochip from under her boss's noses. So that's where you came in. She hired you. And brought this all on herself. On you two. There's one more recording. Wanna see it? Sure, why not? Nothing can surprise me at this point. Oui, oui, allez. Nous t'as qu'une raison, moi, c'est tout intelligent pour ça, pour t'es une bien. On ne pas enragé. On plie. C'est plus bon moyen de nous gagner pour nous arriver sur un nouveau. Faut que nous prouvions cela. Vous gagnez plus bon l'idée? Très bien. Si vous décidez si c'est bon critique, ça me pense. À continuer à faire le travail. What language is she speaking? I don't know. Haitian Creole? It is the Voodoo Boys. Didn't I? Wait, let me see if I've got an auto translator. Meantime, you try to tune into the phone's frequency. See what the other side's saying. We are about to find it. Try scanning the. Got it. Give it a second. Heard her mention Yorinobu. Probably why Evelyn buried this recording deep. Cut another name. Something like Silverhand? We have to know what they're saying. It could be important. Fine. Just found the auto translate package. Should get along fine with your system. I'll install it now. <laughs> Oui, oui, allez. Vous avez une raison, moi, c'est tout intelligent pour ça, pour tes bien. Vous pensez, moi, c'est la fin de problème? Moi, je n'ai pas enragé. En plus, c'est le plus bon moyen de nous gagner pour nous arriver sur le monde. Il faut que nous portions cela. Moi, je n'ai pas même j'ai avec vous. Qui s'il veut aller nous nous tirer sur Alt? Vous avez une plus bonne idée? Très bien. Si vous décidez si c'est bon critique, ça me pense. À continuer à faire le travail. Vous pouvez avoir des filles. Vous avez trop de 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 filles. Vous avez trop Okay, Jimmy, we're good. All right, disconnecting. I don't get it. What's this have to do with Johnny Silverhand? He died like forever ago. V, you got any idea? The biochip we stole. It's, uh... It's got Silverhand's engram burned onto it. Engram? Digitized psyche. Personality construct. Q. 
Can you give me a minute? I need to go over some stuff in my head. Uh, um, of course. Know who they are, who the woman is. Any idea how we find them? Fuck, V. I've been dead the last half century. Sorry if I'm unable to hand you all the answers on a chrome fucking platter when you snap your fingers. These people, what could they want from Alt? How the hell should I know? Got no notion whatsoever? One way or another, everything leads back to that Netrunner. Finding her is our biggest priority. If she knows as much as I think she knows about the chip, she can help us out. Thought you said nothing could help us. Nah, just find us that Juju Wirehead, okay? Wait, you got any idea how to get in touch with the Voodoo Boys? I'll ask around, make a few calls. Let me put it this way. The Voodoo Boys wouldn't trust a cat if it walked onto their turf. But someone's gotta know a way in. Well, good luck. I hope you won't need it. Thanks, Judy. No, V. Thank you. You're a... You're a good person. Evelyn could never see what was under people's skin. If she could have gotten to know you a bit better, then... Who knows? Things might have turned out differently. Huh. Interesting. This place looks like a fucking antique museum. Then I guess you should feel right at home. Chick's got taste. That all you have to say? And she's nice. Six out of ten. Didn't know she dabbled in robotics. Now that's fucking Shimra. Think that's how she winds down? After a day's work of tuning hardcore smut? Wouldn't be surprised. Need to make contact with the Voodoo Boy's chief if you can swing it. All right, all right. Straight to heavy business. Hmm. Now, that'd be Maman Brigitte. Be tough getting a word into her. Huh. I was led to believe you could arrange anything. Ha! <laughs> now that sounded like my third wife every time she wanted a new purse. Maman Brigitte. And that sounds like a spooky cult alias. Have not had the pleasure of asking her personally. But it is what everybody calls her. Doubt the title has any real religious weight, though. Voodoo boys play pretty fast and loose with their Haitian heritage. You really don't do any biz with them? Not with the chefs, chefins, priests, and whatnot. All got dirigible-sized egos, won't talk to lowly me. But if you insist, I can ask around, try to set something up. I'll just need some details first. Uh, got something they want. Truly? Want to sell something to the VDBs? Trust me, they don't want it, they don't need it. They're isolated, insulated, they got their own contracts, tech, networks. But, have it your way. Okay, I'll see what I can do and get back to you.
Here to see Rogue, expecting me. Hey Rogue, I'm back. What about Hellman? Two, please. Make some room. Sit down. Hope you found him. Don't see that often, determination like yours. Must really need this guy. Matter of life and death. <laughs> Haven't heard that for a while either. Bottle stays. Go ahead. Enjoy. To your health. To yours, kid. Gonna need it. Thanks, Nix. Queen of the afterlife. Who would have thunk? Got a shard for you. Intel. Interesting stuff. Let's see what you got. Your Hellman's not on any payroll, not officially anyway. But he does pop up in GNT's confidential stacks. It's a Kang Tao subsidiary, Chinese Corp. Kang Tao's been using them as a fig leaf for years. They're masked for more sensitive operations. All that clear? Think you can track him down? Getting a mark on him ought to be easy. Actually grabbing him? Another story entirely. Decrypted map of upcoming Kang Tao convoy routes. Think Hellman might be in one of them? Thing is, which one? Take a look at the specs on this one. A lone AV, no ground support, no linked cargo manifests either. Weird. Sure, Kang Tao sometimes transports stuff unregistered if they want to push it under the table, but catch the load on this AV. Already approved in the system, but too low. So definitely no cargo on board. Huh. But there's a passenger list. Kang Tao security detail plus one VIP. Transfer from Chan T. Our boy Hellman. That was the good news. There it is. So what's the bad news? Bad news is the extraction site. Look, Night City airspace. All this. Mm-hmm. No way to jack the transport without the NCPD picking up on it. And here, we're too close to Kang Tao. We even give that AV a dirty look, their backup hustle will be on us. But right here's Jackson Plains. Narrow corridor just outside the city and just out of Kang Tao's reach. Guess it's your lucky day. A dead zone. I'll grab him there. 
Gonna need a native to the area. Someone who'll set up the op, cobble together the gear. Even tracking that AV will be a bitch. Familiar with the type. Saw legacy models flying around during the war. They're mammoth, but they're quick. Plus they pack next-gen defenses. Can't take pot shots at it. Not even with serious firepower. Just won't work. It's not about firepower. There are ways, and people who know them. Or who can at least improvise on a theme. So a native. Know any hick mercs? Just one. Pan Am Palmer. She can't count on her clan anymore, but she's a true nomad. She knows those lands. And she will help you. Won't have a choice. Won't have a choice? Does not sound enticing. Not for her, not for me. Enticing comes at a price you can't possibly afford. Can't possibly afford to blow this chance at Nab and Hellman. Your operation, your call. Got a bad feeling, V. Strange. Thought nomads gave the city and city folk a wide berth. Varies by clan, by the connections they have, the depth of shit they're in. But you're right. Aldecaldos are rarely willing to do biz with the city. Pan Am's got a different take? Yep, on everything, it seems. Why's Pan Am gotta help me? I sense a catch. Pretty big one. Occasionally, Pan Am moves merch for me. Last job? Well, wasn't a good day for her. She run into a hitch? Complete bust, actually. Lost the goods and her ride. Pan Am will do anything to get the load back. Means her dignity. I know her. Okay. Guess I can try to help her. But if we don't know where to look, I mean... We do. I do. You know, but wouldn't tell Pan Am. Aim to play cat and mouse with me too? My aim is to know an opportunity when I see one, and then to seize it. Say I told her everything. What do you think she'd have done? Grabbed her iron and gone on the warpath, that's what. Not hard to see how that could end it. And there's nothing I hate more than losing good people to plain stupidity. Huh. I'm her only chance, and she's my only chance. Two pawns on Rogue's board. You're quick. For a pawn. Oh, V. Fine. Let me hear what you know. Rocky Ridge, ghost town just outside Night City. Pan Am knows where. You'll go there, get the merch back. Wheels too. Naturally, you'll call her first. Sending you her deeds. Oh, finally. Let's get out of All clear. Thanks. Good luck. Yeah. Hang on just a little longer, too. Ripper's on the way. <coughs> oh, I, I can't. Who would have thought? Pan Am? V here. V who? V where? How did you even get this number? I'm Rogue. Oh, uh, great. Fuck. Where's that old warhorse want to kick me now? Forget Rogue for a minute. I want to help you. Oh, very kind. But it's far too little, far too late. So do tell Rogue she can eat my shorts. Tell it to your therapist. Call him about your ride and the merch you lost. Interested? Or are you gonna tell me to eat your shorts too? The rail freight yard on Benita Street. The one hugging the city line. We'll meet there. See ya.
Hey, Pan Am? So you're a V. Where's my car? Why does it matter? What's wrong with this one? It's borrowed. It's not mine. I asked where my car is. <laughs> Agree to help me. You'll find out. Oh, fuck no. You will not jerk me around. Tell me where my car is. Hey, come on. Calm down. Don't tell me what to do. Fine. Know where to find the cargo and your car. If you go alone, you won't get him back. And you could lose something else besides. So let's figure something out. What do you want? Need to hit a Kang Tao transport. Won't be easy. Wanna know I can count on you. Are you out of your goddamn mind? About you or the job. Kang Tao's AV route will take it over Jackson Plains. Heard that should help us. Yeah. I doubt it. Gonna be a guy on board. Need to talk to him. Fuck. In return, inform your cargo. Help in getting back what's yours. We got a deal? I don't know. I... Shit! All right, deal. But if you want your thing done, we'll need to get my Thornton back first. So where is it? I thought this was mostly about the merch. Fuck the merch. With that ride, I can take any transport job in town. Without it, the only thing I can move is pizza. Maybe. Cars in Rocky Ridge. You're supposed to know where that is. Cars there, goods are there. Nash, you dirt-eating bastard. I will strangle you. Nash, you chew me yours? He hang you out to dry? Do not call him that. Fine. Partner. Former. If ever. The shift tricked me. Straight and nipped my truck and the merch. Probably now aims to sell it off in Rocky Ridge. Is he ever going to be fucking disappointed? Rocky Ridge. Let's go. Uh, hang on. I, I, I should think this through. Yes. We'll need backup. We have one brief stop to make on the way. Want to tell me where? Give me a sec. I should call the client. Convince them to leave the bastard hanging. Going ahead with the deal behind Rogue's back. Brave, I guess. Or fucking dumber than a drum. Buzz! Hey! Now she's gonna pass you the merch in Rocky Ridge. The thing is, the motherfucker screwed me over. Boz, I will take care of it. I just need you to give me a chance. Boz, come on. How many times have I moved things for you? And how many times have I failed? You have my word. After dark? Okay. No, don't call off the meat. Just don't show up. I'll take care of everything. Do you even have to ask? Of course I will. Thanks, Boz. You won't regret this. Okay. I have bought us some time. Boz? Vista Del Rey, Boz? Had no idea you drive for 6th Street. Is that not allowed? No, nothing wrong with it. They still wild about stars, stripes, and core heartland values. A strong word, wild. And I don't care. They pay well. It's simple. So... Where to now? The Aldecaldo camp. I need to see some of the old clan. Don't seem too excited. That's not your concern. I still have friends there. Rogue mentioned your friends. Said you guys stopped seeing eye to eye. Well, since Rogue said so, it must be true. It isn't? You mean to irritate me. Okay, then. It was just a hiccup. They're still family. So it's complicated. You might say so, yes. Any chance they might help us? In Rocky Ridge? That is the plan. Good, let's roll. Get in.
Nice ride. Lots of space. Practical. Say no more. Please. How the hell did you land in this mess? I like the color. The air freshener and booster seat came extra. You know I don't mean the car. What am I supposed to tell you? That I'm not about to let my partner rob me and get away with it? That my fixer made me look like a goddamned fool? What about you? Why do you need that clown from the AV? This particular clown's got intel I need. And I'm running out of time to get it. So why didn't she tell me she knew about Nash? Rogue? Do better not to wonder what her agenda might be. God damn, I can't stand the bitch! Rogue's queen of the afterlife. Plays her pawns as she pleases. Did you just call me a pawn? I got a good look at her. She rose to the top because she reads people. So what if she keeps things to herself? It's a skill in her profession. Well, I think she's a lying, manipulative bitch. She put me together with that Raffin. Did you know that? Must have had her reasons. You don't say. Rogue won't open her mouth without weighing the for and against. What to spill and what to withhold. We're almost there. We'll gather my guys, then ride to Rocky Ridge. Look what the cat dragged in. Is that a ghost or is it just my hangover? Fuck you too. Mm-hmm. And who's this? My babysitter. V, this is Scorpion. Mitch. Two old friends. Hey, guys. Hello. What brings you to these parts, city girl? The big city got too small for her. Do you have any idea how angry the old man's gonna be when he sees you here? I've just come by for a spell. Saul needn't know a thing. Need your help. With what? What's this about? Raffin screwed Pan Am. Plan is to show him that was a bad idea. How bad did they get you? Bad enough to make me sit quietly through all your bullshit. You know we would do anything for you, sister. But now? Now's hard. Seriously? You won't help? Uh, well, the old man told us to... Sit tight and get those generators back up after the batteries went kaput. Generators? You won't help because of some goddamn generators? Is this another joke? Really could use your help. Not this time. We're needed here. Fuck. I don't believe this. So you'll stay put because Saul told you to. You couldn't care less about me. Pan Am. This isn't about Saul. It's about the clan. You know that. 
Listen, we can't leave camp, no chance, but... But Saul never said a thing about gear. Okay. Well, I'll need that rifle of yours. And some of my own stuff. Take whatever you want. And take care of yourself out there. Yeah. yeah. Thanks, guys. I'll grab the gear, then be out of your hair. Looks like you're stuck with me. Mm-hmm. You disappointed? I don't know. Maybe a little, yes. Our biz won't settle itself. Hey, Pan Am, are you staying a while? No, I'll be going again soon. We'll talk next time. Hey, Pan Am. Have you brought someone new? Want to see what you got in stock? Browse to your heart's content. Have you brought someone new? Does Saul know? Not your concern, friend. Will you help me with this? What's inside? A few odds and ends that should be useful. Take it. All right, that's everything. Let's go. Figure out your differences with Saul. Will you come back? Pan Am, you'll stop by later, right, honey? Next time, Ellie. I promise. So. I'm off. Yeah, yeah, go on, go already. Call us sometime. Keep an eye on her, V. Put it in the trunk. We can go. Hop in. Mitch and Scorpion seem good souls. The best friends a girl could ask for. I'd stay in the camp too if I were in their shoes. Fuck Saul and his generators, of course. Yet the clan comes first. But I'm not part of it anymore. Still treated you like you're one of them. They care about you. Mm-hmm. Do you have anyone you would call close? Haven't been so lucky. I see. Were those two in the army? Scorp and Mitch? Yeah. Panzer boys. They were on contract during the last war. Panzer boys? Flew those huge transporters? Scorpion piloted. Mitch ran security. They both got some kick-ass combat implants and a stack of really fucked up nightmares. So Rocky Ridge. Empty, dusty hole in the middle of bumfuck nowhere, I heard. Natives either moved to Night City or just got the hell out. Then you know almost all there is to know. The whole area was waiting on a new interstate extension. It was supposed to breathe new life into the town. It didn't happen, of course. How many ghost towns do you think are there? Hundreds? Countrywide? Thousands. I drove down I-80 the other day. All you have to do is pull over after sundown. It's quiet then. And you hear it. What's that? The wind whistling through boarded up windows. Tumbleweeds scratching across dry, sandy tracks. That's how towns die. Not with a bang, 
but with whispers and whimpers. Seems you got a real problem with authority. What? Rogue, Saul. He your leader? Their leader. Seemed in a hurry to delta the hell out of there. Let's just say Saul wouldn't have been happy to see me. What happened? The reason we came to California was because he promised change for the Elder Caldos. He claimed we would turn over a new leaf. But you saw it. We got a handful of tents on a heap of sand. A hell of a promised land. I wanted something different. Better. Saul's a damned coward. He'll be the end of the clan, I'm certain. Okay, we have arrived. What do we do? We get ready to greet the Raffins, and we have little time for that. We'll need to improvise. We should scout first, to look for anything that might be useful. <laughs> 